Hello, YouTubers, and welcome to the Rodney1279 channel on this January 5th day of 2014. Now, this is going to be a two-part video. The first part is a message video telling, and this is for the Chicagoland area and also for the people who live in the Midwest, stay y'all asses at home. That's the bottom line. Stay y'all asses at home. Y'all need to go out. Because it's going to be 17, well here in the Chicago land area, it's going to be 17 below zero tomorrow. Y'all do not need to be going out nowhere. Unless y'all really have to go out, I would say stay home. Because it's going to be dangerously cold out there. That's what I'm saying. Gary agrees with me with that, don't you, Gary? Yeah, you hear Gary saying, but it's going to be even worse than that. If you go out there, it's going to be frostbitten in conditions. It's going to get mildly, well not mildly, but it's going to get very, very, very cold here. Not just in Chicago, but here in New York as well. It's going to get really freezing. So I suggest keep your bottoms home. Yes, I'm telling y'all, and the only reason why I'm doing that because I care about the folks out there. You know, when I say be safe and be careful, take care of everybody. I'm be meaning that, y'all. And this is my way of saying this, literally. Y'all better stay home tomorrow. I'm say saying, because this, this weather is no joke out there. I was out there for a couple hours shoveling snow. It was a lot of snow out there. So, it's not easy to snuff, shovel all that snow that is out there. It was like about two feet of snow out there. So, y'all stay home. Now we got that out of the way, that safety on this out of the way, I do want to talk about one thing that has been bothering me lately. And it has to do, and I, I, I really want to talk to Mark face to face, it's the better way of doing it. But it has to do with Mark um, doing his password. I did get a Facebook post saying that he's going to do um, Super Password on his channel. And is it Password Plus or Super Password? I think Password Plus. He's doing Password Plus? Okay, Password Plus on his channel. My thought is this, Mark. You have to be able to know what you're doing when you're hosting these shows. You needed to read the instructions on the last game when you was doing Password. So what makes you think you can do Password Plus? To me, Mark, I think you're doing it because, I mean, you see that I'm doing it. And I mean, my thing is, Mark, you need to come up with your own ideas for your own channel. It's just that simple. You can't duplicate off of nobody's ideas. Because what may work for one person may not work for you, Mark. You know, you have anything you want to say about that, Gary? To be honest, because I've been keeping this in my system for a long time, I do not need to be rude at all. Why? y'all to let me know if I'm not doing a good job too. Just putting y'all um, 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 in the post under the video and stuff. And also, you know, y'all have every right to dislike my videos or like them because I want to know what I'm doing right on my channel or what I'm not doing right on my channel because this is YouTube. This is a social networking site. I want to communicate with you guys and I want y'all to be entertained on my channel. And that's why I want y'all to uh, realize, because I care about you guys on um, on uh, this channel. And um, But Mark, I mean, the reason why I don't like his password that much, Gary, is the fact that he be um, 
making those buzzing noises and stuff. It is not necessary to do that. Gosh. I'm not going to lie, but especially that I, I, I've had my headset on a couple times. I literally throw them off when I was in the living room because for me, I do have sensitive ears. Yeah. And there's some that hurts my ears. I just throw my headsets off and I get a little aggressive. Yeah. When I do it, is this, I don't even do all of that when the time is up, like if they have five seconds and let's say if they do have five seconds on um, the clock saying that to get that clue out or get that right password out, if they don't get it in with that time limit, I just go on to the next person. I don't buzz them out like that. Because Mark, you come off to me in your videos, I watch your password videos, Mark, you come off as like being upset during the password game. Am I the only one that realized that? Uh, I sort of realized that. I mean, for me, for me, when I, I don't need to talk about myself a little bit, but when I was Men of Fortune, I like to have the sympathy to make the audience, not just the contestants and the audience have fun on the show, because I like to interact with everybody that is on the call, not if they're playing the game or not, because I like to have fun with everybody and have, make everybody entertain. I'm sure Robbie probably does the same thing. Yeah. But I mean, Mark, if you want to do password, you can go ahead and do it on your channel if you want to. And you know what? I'll probably step away from doing, you know, password myself and let you do it. Since you think you're the better one to doing it. But I'm just telling you, Mark, people are not liking the way you're doing your game. Password. I'm telling you, because you have to know what you're doing on there. And that's all I have to say. I don't have anything else on my mind because I'm just speaking from my heart right now, Mark. Because it seems like you want to duplicate everything I do on my channel. You want to duplicate my sayings. You want to duplicate my gameplays and stuff. And you have to come up with your own ideas. See, one thing for me is I, I'm in the stuff here. So me, I don't know about... I mean, me and Ryan are not trying to mean or anything. We're just giving the honest, we're just being honest with you because we're not, we don't dislike, we love you, Mark, but uh, we're just giving the honest opinion. We're just giving our honest thoughts. Yeah. I mean, and many people don't like your style, Mark. The people that gave you those five dislikes on your password video, we gave you those dislikes, Mark. It wasn't just any random person. We did it because we don't like your style the way you host. I was one of the people. I'm not right. very admitted. Right. I mean, you know, we're not just all disliking your video for no reason and stuff, but we're saying that, you know, you just don't have it, Mark. Even in the board game, the way the board game is played is this. In the board game, now you said that you're only supposed to do five words in a full game, a password. In the board game, if you want to do it, do it the board game way, the board game has you to do 10 passwords. That means five passwords from each player. And the last two words are worth double. So really you're doing 10 passwords in the game, not five. Uh, at least 10 to 15 is just a good minimum amount number. Right. And I mean, me, I did it. The reason why I did it, like the show, is because I mean, I, that's the one I'm more familiar with with the um, Alan Ludden version and to make it all nice, to make my games look really nice, I have the, um, the uh, background, the actual setup for, from the original password back in the 60s just to make it, um, make it look like password. It looks nice. Yeah. And it comes from the website quizx.com and I thank them for allowing me to use it. And, um, uh, yeah, go ahead, Gary. Don't mean to get off topic. Get it out. Check out the website. Excellent. It's an excellent website. If you're a game show fanatic, check it out. Great website. Very excellent. I think that's all I got to say right now, Gary. Um, is there anything you want to say? Uh, I have nothing else to say. I have really nothing much to say except I did want to talk about the Skype Game Show Network, but I don't know if we should or not. If you want go to ahead and talk about it. Basically, I did this on my page, I might as well say it. It was the con if anybody gets confused, everybody's been 
saying it's me who came up with it. It's not just me. Me and Ronnie came up with it together. I mean, we were joking around about the Skype game show network about GSN, you know, yada, 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 about Family Feud. So I brought up Skype and one out there, and basically we just did Skype game show network, and Ronnie came up with the owl from a Jeopardy episode. Yeah. How it originated. And the, look, and the phrases, I think you came up with the phrase. Where you don't have to watch Family Feud uh, 24 fucking hours a day or f- fucking times a day. Yeah, I think you came up with that phrase. Yeah. yeah. I mean, I did that out of joking this, but in a way, I'm serious about it. Because, I mean, that's another thing, Jess, and you can't show Family Feud all these times a day. What happened to the shows like Joker's Wild? And Tic Tac Doe and Bullseye and Pop Potato and all that. And Old Wheel Forger. I mean, from right. the olden days, like the early 2000s, early, late the 90s, 80s, those decades from the Old Wheel. Yep, but I'm going to keep on saying that um, the only network where you don't have to watch Family Feud 24 times a day and until the, y'all get y'all act together. And the only network where people actually do all that. Right. Right, and we've been meaning that. Well, guys, I think I'm going to take a break. Um, I'm going to take a break and get myself warmed up a little bit because I was shuffling all this time. But I think when we return, I might do a special gameplay. So we'll be right back after this. Don't go away. <laughs> 